Hi y'all, I'm Sherry Black. Thank you for joining me today. I wanted to talk today about fake eyelashes. I got these false scara by Kiss eyelashes at Walmart and I paid $18 for these. And I just wanted to see, uh, I wanted to try these. My birthday's coming up and I thought, you know, it'd be neat to try fake lashes because I usually just wear mascara. But anyway, um, the eye, the fake eyelashes is very big right now. Everybody's wearing them. They go and get eyelash extensions and they're very beautiful. They're long and they look real. They look like you're natural. You don't have to do anything. You just get up and go. And, but it is expensive and I do recommend that you get a license or a, a certified tech to do your lashes. I'm a cosmetologist, but you know, you do need to be certified and you do want someone that's certified that knows what they're doing because the glue is very dangerous. If they get it in your eye, you could go blind. And uh, you know, you just want someone that knows what they're doing. I thought about maybe getting certified for that. I don't know, I'm thinking about it, but I've never had mine done. But for $18, this is kind of neat to try. So I thought I might just give it a try. Uh, you know, $18 isn't like $200. So, and also you do have to get them refilled like every month and that can add up to $60 per month for refills. It adds up and these you can take off at night. You can, I suggest that you buy the um, remover in case they do sell a remover and I do have it. I just don't have it here right at the moment, but uh, you do need those that remover to take them off so you won't damage your eyelashes. And uh, these go under the eye. Uh, you just take this section and like do this eye and this section and do this eye. So I thought I would just try it and see. Um, I don't know. I, I'm gonna let y'all be the judge of that and see what you think. And, I, and this is my first time trying them. So I'm excited. Let's just see. I'm gonna do them. I'm gonna show y'all how to do them or at least this is my first time. I hope I do it correctly. Okay, let's do it. I'm opening the package right now and I've got this out and these strips come on this little thing that you can take out. And also this is the, um, the seal and the bond. So I don't know, I'm doing this for the first time. Uh, so first of all, what I would do is I would make sure that you, um, let's look at these. Now let's make sure that these come loose. Uh oh. See, that one's already getting damaged. Let's see, I need to be very careful. I um, I don't know. Oh, there's, oh, I know why. They have, there's something sealed over the top. So take this off. See, because if you don't, you'll tear them, okay? So let's take this off, this little piece here. So, what you want to do is, let me see if this is loose. Okay, there we go. So, that's what you want to do. I just found out that if you don't do that, you're going to damage them. You've got to take, see, I just opened it and found out for myself. So, this you've got to take off because if you pull it, it's going to tear. Okay, so what I'm going to do, it says to bond, to take the bond first. So this side's the bond, bond, okay. So, oh, so it goes like this, okay. And don't do it real heavily. So let's just lightly take this and paint it on or brush it on, okay. Now, I think it says don't go heavy with the bond. I'm about to drop these. So, uh-oh, I did drop one. <laughs> you gotta be careful. <laughs> so, anyway, what you wanna do is take your little Ok, 
okay now get your next one and get it in position and like I said I'm doing this for the first time and line it up I'm sorry if I'm not angled correctly I don't know, they seem, I don't know, I think I've got it too much on my uh, eyelash here, Let's, I mean on my, okay, so do the next one, and just be careful, like I said, these things, it's probably very wise to take them off this thing and loosen them a little bit. And uh, I think I dropped one, did I? No. You don't really feel them too much if you do it correctly. I might have to, um, one thing, that I recommend that you buy the glue, okay? Very important, I mean, the glue remover or the oil that comes with it to take them off because I feel like you've got to have that because you need to take them off or you're gonna tear your own eyelashes. So, as you can see right here, I don't know if I want to add any more right here. I know, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to like that, but um, the way my eyelashes are shaped, I don't know if I want anything right here or not. Because um, see, I've got two more left. So I don't know. My eyes are shaped weird. <laughs> okay, so I don't know. I'm gonna try the other side. So let's see. I, I don't know. The thing is, I, I'm feeling you don't wanna to get too close to the eyelid because uh, that could be a pain in the butt. So let's try, let me try the other side. But what I would suggest is to take this and gently lift this up lightly because uh, they're all the same length so I'm sticking them in this little tray because I, the thing is when you lift it up if you get in a hurry it tears so I, that's what I would do I would just uh, um, do I would just get them in here lightly and you do want them to have, you want them going the right way. You don't want them. And did I drop? Yes, I dropped one right here on my dress. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. This is kind of new for me, too, because I never wear fake lashes. I always just, these are my natural ones. I mean, I'm, they're not that long, but they're long enough. So... Okay, so let me try, let's do this again. Let's take the bond. Like this, okay. And it says to go lightly on it, on the bond. I just pulled it out, I didn't double dip in there. Okay, let's try this, and let's just see. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get it in position, and also, I think, let's see. Now, 
Now, I've watched other people do this, and they did it with the breeze. But, you know, a lot of women wear, do, do wear fake eyelashes every day, so they're very quick with this kind of thing. They're, they're pros. Whereas someone, if you're like me, and you never wear false eyelashes, um, this could be a little bit tricky for you. And um, anyway, they say that you can do it. The people that I have seen a video of this, they do it really quickly. Some people have trouble, some people don't. But um, I'm having a little bit of an issue. But And... very beautiful um, but I don't know if y'all can see this but what I did is I I glue one the next one beside that one and the next one now I'm wondering I didn't do I only did three over here and I've still got two more left to do on this side and it's the same over here on the left so, hmm, I mean, it's, maybe I got these way too long. I don't know. I mean, it's great. I'm not sure. I mean, they're beautiful, and I really don't feel like I have anything on. They're really, I, 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 I do need to do this one, I feel like. So, let me see if I can go ahead and get my uh, tweezers in line to do this. I need to twist it this way. Let me try it this way. Like this. And I don't know. Let's see. This is a hard angle. Um, I'm not sure. Not really. Maybe I need to apply some more bond. Um, let me try that. I may not like this, but I'm gonna try it because I, I feel like they're extremely long for my eyes because um, I don't know. I, I re they're really beautiful. Let's see. Line that up. Well, sorry, y'all. <laughs> I don't think it's going to work. Uh, Yeah, it's not gonna, I, I don't know. I, I don't think I can get them. I kind of like them in the outer edges. Um, but to me, I feel like if I try to get them, they're not really, I don't know if I have enough eyelash right here for them to grab onto. But they are so beautiful. I feel really, I don't know. What do y'all think? Comment. <laughs> I'm not sure. I like them, and I don't. I don't really feel like I have anything. I don't feel like they're bother me. But I do think with my eye shape, I always have issues if I try a strip of fake lashes because I feel like they don't work with my eyes because I I have I guess almond shaped eyes and they don't. They always even if I trim them, I feel like I just need the outer edges done, and I just didn't wear them. So. I don't know, but I like these just, I guess it depends on the, each individual person. And if your eyes are really big 
you could do all the little strips because as you can see I have um, two on this side and the two here so I don't know but I don't feel like I have them on now what you have to do is take your sealer which is here and it says to go I always turn it the wrong way so go ahead and seal these in if you like them I guess okay and do the same on this side and uh, I don't know we'll see I'm gonna wear them today and see how I feel I don't I hope I've got them all good uh, they feel yeah they feel pretty good um, let me see I don't know what do y'all think <laughs> well anyway <laughs> I feel pretty I do feel pretty with them on so anyway thank you for watching hi y'all see this is what they look like I don't know what do y'all think I know I didn't do the the two extra ones on this side and the two on this side because my eyelashes won't hold them I don't know everybody's different so anyway I don't know um, but I think they're they're neat if you want to have a little extra something instead of mascara and I think they'll be easy to take off but please whatever you do make sure you buy the remover and it's like five bucks and it's in a little bottle uh pink it's pink i'm sorry i didn't show y'all but it is uh the remover so i would suggest that you get that because you need to take them off at night and you need to wash your face uh every night before you go to bed because it's very important and i do make homemade lotion bars and i'll have to show y'all my handmade stuff that i make it's so good for your skin once you use it uh, especially my new formulation for the face and it's so awesome your skin will just glow and be beautiful at least I love it my husband loves it too and we have family that love it so and and I have customers who just love my stuff so uh, it is good for your skin and it's anti-aging but I do recommend that you take your eyelashes off at night before bed anyway but thank you y'all for watching and y'all have a wonderful day thank you